Now the subject for this video is control starts at breath. Now I've been experimenting with something. Recently I finished um, my session for uni or my semester for uni. So I have a three or four month break until next year's session begins again. So during this break I've been doing a lot of work. I've been working 10 hour days, 12 hour days at this casual job I have where I pack um, packages from the back dock into stores, pretty much just packing things in the stores and moving pallets around and stuff like that. Now naturally this job is boring as all fuck when you're in there for 10 hours, 11 hours, 12 hours doing the same repetitive stuff over and over again. And it got to the point where I dreaded going back to work you know you work one day you go to sleep and you have to think about working the next day you don't you don't really want to do that and i realized that everything all our perspectives come from beliefs right someone who's new to the gym when they have are forced to exert themselves the pain they feel is bad pain be going to gym is a chore Whereas a professional IFBB bodybuilder, they love that burn. Same pain, the same burn, the same sensation, but two completely different perspectives. And because of their perspectives and their beliefs that they hold on the pain, their quality of life changes. The bodybuilder loves being in the gym and feeling that burn. The newcomer hates it. So since work is a necessary part of life, regardless of where you want to be, if you want to be an entrepreneur, you still have to work at some stage to make a bit of money to start your ventures or if you just want to further yourself in your careers get those advancements you're still gonna to have to work some of these um, tedious jobs at the lower levels I figured it would be a good idea to try and make work a positive experience so I changed my mindset to it instead of dreading work I saw work as a way for me to work on my mindfulness Medit as a meditative practice so that my 10 hours or 8 hours at work were not just in vain or not just for money I actually got something out of it so the thing that I've been doing recently is whenever I'm at work especially when I'm doing something repetitive moving the pallet jack around or stacking shelves or whatever I try focus on the breath because control begins at your breath and what you realize is like any other meditative um, practice you have very little control you try focus on each breath something that should be very simple something that should come naturally and you forget about this practice and your mind will drift off and you get lost in thought for the next 30 minutes for the next 40 minutes next hour just to remember that you are meant to be mindful so you go back to your breath you um, observe it you observe your inhale you observe your exhale the sensations everything associated with it and the same thing happens again. You forget about it after maybe a minute or two. And then for the next hour, you're lost in thought. You quickly realize that you don't have as much control as you once believed you had. If you think about everything you're doing or what you're doing right now, a lot of things are um, faculties of the subconscious mind. You do them automatically. They're automated. But mindful control, full conscious effort, is something we have in limited amounts and it's something you have to cultivate if you want to be mindful if you want to regain your focus or gain your focus and control for the first time in your life you need to focus on it you need to work on it it's just like a muscle just like when you're at the gym and you're building the bicep or when you're working on your mathematics and you're increasing your proficiency at that same thing with mindfulness and same thing with the art of living you have to work on it so I've been doing this practice and I believe it's very crucial. It's a very good thing that you guys can implement to your day. And what you quickly notice is that your quality of life during work increases. You sometimes get into a flow state once you get deep into this um, med meditative practice where the 10 hour shift, the 12 hour shift goes by quickly because you're very present and it's not as boring as if you were just lost in thought doing this stuff so that's something you guys can take and implement 
hopefully come back and tell me what you think of it tell me if it helps and of course you have to work on it it's not you're gonna see results straight away give it some time and you will reap the rewards anyway that's the quick video for today guys um another video coming soon just stay tuned like subscribe and share this shit peace Just do it!